Yo, 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 what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, The Wolf, here, bringing you guys another Hopper video, a little Hopper update video. Um, so far, it's been going pretty well. Pretty well, I must say. Um, I did have one of my subs ask me to kind of do a little review on one of the signals that I follow. And um, I'll jump into that a little bit later, but... As you guys can see, these are my current positions right now. Some reds. Um, not too worried right now. But uh, as far as the hopper goes as in general, now the stats that are on the app are a little bit more detailed um, analytical-wise. Uh, I mean, these still obviously give me some numbers, but as you can see, these are the current stats for the daily profits or where I'm at so uh, I've had some good days had some bad days but this stat right here is pretty interesting so these are the profits based on my sell triggers as you can see currently right now I've done two that were profits which were four percent and then 39 that were trying stop losses at the average of 1.70 and I've had six stop losses but if you add that together with 47 trades, so out of the 47, 41, I've uh, done positive. So pretty good. Average holding time right now is eight hours. Um, and the total average profits right now is at 1.0%. And I'll probably go down if I have some losses. Uh, was at 1.21%. And uh, as far as my most traded coins go right now, it's Vibe, Sys, Arc, Band, and Quartz. Wow, yes, yeah, those are the top ones. Um, what's it called now on the app, which I might do a review just you know to show you guys the better detail analytics as far as especially the stats go because I want to say it has like my total I've done so far since uh, I kind of returned this thing back on, and you can kind of see where I'm getting most of my profits from as far as signals wise. So, um it's interesting enough, I'm only getting a lot of buys off of the signals that are free. Interesting enough. And they're doing pretty solid, as you can see. Um, but as far as the trade history goes, kind of give you guys an idea of how well I've been do doing. Um, especially October. So these are some of the trades from today. Uh, you see I've had some greens, had some, had some reds. Um, but a lot more greens than red. So like from here on now, I think it's like a pretty good green streak that I have where, yeah, as you can see. So I've had some where I've done like, you know, 12 greens in a row, 13. Um, and it's interesting enough ever since, and I hate to say it, I turned off, uh, the what was it the nakamoto signals so i turned off the nakamoto signals because i was getting i think i was getting a lot more uh losses with that signal on because i had paused it so i want to show you guys so you come down the signals um so as you can see it's paused right now so these are the four that i'm working with at the current moment and like I said, ever since I've paused this, I've had a lot more wins than losses. More, I should say, actually, more consecutive wins um, than losses, which is pretty cool to see. Um, definitely thinking about opening up another hopper on different exchange just to see uh, if I can do produce the same results on another exchange with you know some of these same signals. So. Um, hopefully I can get that done, I would say, within the next month or so. But, you know, it just depends on money, of which is, of course, always the source of things. But that's just kind of an update as far as October goes. As you see right now, we're in November. And October is a pretty interesting month as far as Bitcoin goes overall. Uh, we had a nice little run there um, towards, like, I would say, the end of the month. So it's going to be interesting to see what's going to happen in November. And it's going to be interesting to see what this hopper does during that month as well. So that'll wrap up this uh, hopper update video. Um, I'll bring you guys probably another update video, obviously, uh, for the month of November. 
and I might tweak some things uh, signal wise might ask more signals so stay tuned for that so as far as uh, the strategy Nakamoto signal goes um, I wouldn't personally recommend it um, just based off some of the stats I mean if you want to try it out like I said by all means you can try it out because uh, I did have one of my subs ask me about it um, but yeah that'll wrap it up uh, if you guys enjoyed the video make sure you guys share with your friends give it a thumbs up uh, if you guys are new to the channel make sure you guys hit that subscribe button i appreciate you guys subscribing to the channel and uh, until next time y'all take care